Apple is about to do something they haven't done in years. They are preparing to turn their smallest computer into their most dangerous weapon. The 2026 Mac Mini isn't just a spec bump. It is a shift in how we think about desktop computing. We're looking at a machine that fits in the palm of your hand, but rivals the power of professional towers from just two years ago. The shift to the M5 and M5 Pro chips is the headline, but the story goes much deeper. If you thought the M4 redesign was a big deal, you haven't seen anything yet. The internal gains we are seeing in recent leaks suggest that Apple is no longer playing it safe. They are aiming for a performance-to-size ratio that seems physically impossible. Let's talk about the heart of the machine, the M5 chip. According to current information, the M5 will deliver a steady 10 to 15% boost in CPU performance. That sounds modest until you look at the GPU. Reports indicate a potential 45% jump in graphics power. Why is this happening? It's because Apple is moving to a newer architecture optimized for the next generation of software. We are entering the era of Apple intelligence. Every single core in the M5 is being designed with AI in mind. This isn't just marketing fluff. It means faster video rendering, smarter photo editing, and real-time processing that used to require a massive power supply. Despite retaining a 10-core GPU layout on the base model, the efficiency of these cores is being tuned to a level we haven't seen in the consumer market. Now, look at the M5 Pro variant. This is where the Mac Mini stops being a budget computer and starts being a workstation. The leaks point to two very aggressive CPU configurations. You'll likely see a binned 14-core version and a full 16-core version. The top-tier M5 Pro is rumored to pack 12 performance cores and 4 efficiency cores. Think about that for a second. That is a massive amount of heavy lifting power in a chassis the size of an Apple TV. For creators, developers, and researchers, this changes the math. You no longer need a Mac Studio to do professional-grade work. The density of the CPU in the M5 Pro effectively makes it a Mac Studio Mini. It's the ultimate solution for people who want a clean desk but need raw, uncompromised power. But power is nothing without memory. The unified memory architecture of Apple Silicon has always been its secret sauce. For the M5 generation, we expect the RAM to scale in very familiar but welcome ways. The base might stay at 16 gigabytes, but the configurations will likely jump to 24 gigabytes, 48 gigabytes, and even 64 gigabytes for the Pro models. This is crucial because AI tasks are memory hungry. If you are running local LLMs or complex video timelines, that extra RAM is the difference between a smooth experience and a frustrating one. Storage is another area of discussion. While Apple has been stingy with 256 gigabytes in the past, there are strong rumors that 512 gigabytes will finally become the new baseline, with files getting larger and 8K video becoming more common. This move is long overdue. Why is Apple keeping the design the same? To understand the M5, we have to look back at the end of 2024. Apple finally redesigned the Mac Mini for the first time in nearly 15 years. They made it smaller, lighter, and more efficient. The M4 Mac Mini was a triumph. It gave us 16 gigabytes of RAM at a $599 starting price. It was and still is the best value in tech. Because that design is so fresh, Apple has zero incentive to change it for 2026. The thermal envelope of the new chassis was clearly built with the M5 in mind. This means the 2026 model will look identical to the M4 version, including the power button on the bottom. It's a polarizing choice, but Apple is betting that you won't care about the button when you see the benchmarks. Let's talk about the competition. The PC world isn't standing still. Intel and AMD are pushing hard with their latest NPU heavy chips. Snapdragon is trying to take the efficiency crown from Apple. This is why the M5 is so important. Apple needs to maintain its lead in the performance per what category. The M5 is expected to be built on an enhanced 3 nanometer process, or perhaps even a move toward 2 nanometer if TSMC's timelines align. This allows Apple to cram more transistors into the same space without increasing heat. In a tiny box like the Mac Mini, heat is the enemy. By mastering the 3 nanometers process, Apple can give us that 45% GPU boost without making the fan spin up like a jet engine. <sighs> Hen, can you get your hands on it? The release cycle for the Mac Mini has become more predictable. According to the most reliable leaks, Apple is targeting WWDC 2026 for the official announcement. This usually happens in the first week of June. If history repeats itself, pre-orders will open that Friday, 
and the first units will arrive on doorsteps by mid-June. As for the price, don't expect a hike. Apple found a sweet spot at $599. It attracts students, office workers, and hobbyists. By keeping the price at $599 for the M5 and roughly $1,399 for the M5 Pro, they ensure the Mac Mini remains the gateway drug into the Apple ecosystem. It's the perfect price to performance ratio that no one else can quite match. What does this mean for you? If you're sitting on an older Intel Mac Mini or even an M1 model, the M5 is your sign to upgrade. The jump from M1 to M5 will feel like moving from a bicycle to a rocket ship. However, if you just bought the M4, don't feel buyer's remorse. The M4 is a stellar machine. But for those who wait, the rewards are clear. Better AI integration, a massive leap in gaming and graphics power, and a more future-proof memory setup. The Mac Mini M5 is the culmination of everything Apple has learned about silicon over the last five years. It is small, it is quiet, and it is incredibly fast. In conclusion, the Mac Mini M5 is the machine that proves size doesn't matter. It's about efficiency, architecture, and the ecosystem. We are watching the evolution of the desktop PC in real time. Apple is stripping away the bulk and leaving only the power. It is a workstation for the rest of us. If you like the video, please subscribe to the channel. It helps us bring you more deep dives into the future of tech. Share the video with someone who is thinking about buying a new computer and hit the bell icon so you never miss a leak or an update. My best opinion? The M5 Mac Mini will be the most important hidden gem in Apple's 2026 lineup. If you can wait until June 2026, your patience will be rewarded with the most powerful compact computer ever made. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next one.